Hello guys, today we are going to see how to download a file in headless, headless mode of the browser. So let's get started. So first thing is, you first you have to specify the browser path, browser driver path in the system class. So for this you have to do system dot property and if you want to use uh, Firefox then we have to get the code driver here and then specify the driver path let's remove extra separators Now, in order to set uh, yeah, download uh, the file in the browser, whether be it in the incognito mode or be in the head headless mode, we have to set a set of preferences. So for that, we will be using a, a class which is provided by the browser companies. It is called Firefox Profile. So let's set uh, create first create the object of Firefox Profile. Create the object. Okay. All right, guys. Now the next thing is we have to set the preferences. So let's set the preferences. We have to pass it in the key value pair. So uh, guys, please keep uh, this thing in mind that. Uh, you have to pass the attributes very carefully like uh, any uh, any spelling is taken on and it is not going to work so let's uh, set the attributes like uh, first is you have to specify this uh, downloading folder list so you have to give it like this browser dot download dot folder list now you have to specify the value so if you want to download it at a very specific location in your system then you have to give two if you want to download in the downloads folder then you have to give as one and if you want to download um, at by the default setting of the browser then you have to give zero so for this uh, here we are going to download at a specified location so we will give as two okay now the next uh, thing is uh, since we want to download at a specified location then we uh, now the next thing is to give the download directory so let's set the preferences for that set preference mm -hmm. okay now give uh, this directory and then get the directory suppose if you want to if you want to download uh, at this location then let's uh, get this path all right okay we do not want this as of now okay we are good now the next thing is we have to set uh, preferences for the uh, browser to do not uh, give you a pop-up for the downloads options so what uh, what i mean by this line is suppose uh, you use this url for downloading a file now if you go to this url and uh, try to download a file okay 
because of course if i click on this link now the pop-up will come asking to open whether to open or save the file and open if you want to open then what type of application you are going to use so we don't want this to this thing so we have to set a separate set of preferences for this it will be like this profile or set preference as usual and uh, you have to specify this attribute browser dot helper apps dot in our ask dot save to disk all address and then we have to specify the mime type uh, so mime type for excel will be uh, i will explain you what the mime type is uh, for now uh, for um, suppose we are downloading excel file then we have to give mime, mime type like uh, application vnd dot ms hyphen excel so mime types are the type of files and uh, if you want to see the different type of mime types then just go to here browser search mime types Now, if you will go to this site, then we will be having different set of MIME types. Like, uh, okay, this is not the one I'm looking for. List. Okay. So here we can see the list of uh, MIME types. Okay. So this is the way. Okay. So see for uh, excel i have specified this type of mime type again so suppose if you want to you if you want to set mime type for txt then you have to specify this type of mime type okay and you have you can give multiple mime types um, uh, in order to uh, make it generalize make it, make it a generic uh, mime types okay Okay, the, now that uh, we are done with the setting of the preferences, now you have to pass this, pass this set of preferences in order to set a particular profile for a web driver to use. So for that, we are going to use Firefox options class. Okay, so let's create object of Firefox option class. Oops. Options. And we have to set uh, this profile, okay? Set this profile as in this Firefox option class, okay? Dot set profile. Okay. So and pass this reference uh, variable here, okay? Now, if you if you want to. If you want to allow launch the uh, if you want to launch this browser in this uh, headless mode, then you have to add this arguments so that the web driver knows to uh, launch this browser, whether in the incognito mode or headless mode. Or, sorry, incognito incognito mode is for the Google Chrome. Yeah, for Firefox, uh, the, this is called as uh, yeah, uh, private. Okay. So suppose if you want to launch it in the headless mode, then you have to add an option like 
dot add arguments we have to specify the attribute we have to call this argument as this headless okay so that uh, web driver will know that we have to pass uh, when we have to launch this headless mode of browser if you want to the, the launch the private mode then you have to specify as private okay so we want to do it for the headless so we will do it like this okay now the next thing is once we are done with setting up the profile now we have to create object of driver okay create object of Firefox driver and then uh, uh, we have to launch the browser now we'll launch the specified URL so I have saved this URL okay okay now you have to click on the link so let's uh, check the locator what locator we can use for this okay so we can use this one So driver dot find element by dot link text pass this and we have to click on it. Okay. So once we are done, we are going to close the browser. Okay. So let's run. Let's run guys and see. So it is going to Put it in, a, in at this path. So this is the path. Okay. Now let's run this. Okay. It launched the browser, but it shouldn't have. So let's see what is the problem. So, okay, so that's what we need to be very careful. This, okay. So here is spelling mistake. And then I uh, forgot to add this option while creating the object of this Firefox browser drivers. All right, yes. So let's start. Okay. Okay, so our code is executing. We can see the logs, console logs. And uh, it is saying that uh, there is some requests has been made now okay it's done now let's check okay, so you can see that we have got this file over here okay so this is the way you can download the file in the this uh, headless mode now suppose if you want to download the file in the incognito mode and for firefox it is called this private window just pass this argument and run it and see okay what was the problem connection reset okay now let's run it one more time Mm, 
and all that. It has launched the browser now. And uh, closed. And our file is downloaded. So this is the way it is done, guys. Uh, so if you want to just check whether this private window is launched or not, see, uh, you have to look at very uh, quickly. Like you will get a private window icon over here. See, you will get a, see this, this is, it shows that it is a private browsing, okay? So this is the way guys it is done okay downloading file in incognito or private window and uh, this headless mode okay so that's it for now thank you bye bye